That's the way the money makes. All right, guys, what's going on? Today we're going to go over um, something that's going to help a lot of people with chin ups. Um, for most people that get into fitness, it's a good goal. For most, it's a long term goal, um, something people work out a lot, and something people struggle with a lot. Uh, maybe spin their wheels or don't know how to go about it properly, um, so it just kind of never happens. All right, and a lot of people use bands um, as assistance, like the one that we have right here, um, but don't quite know how to use it, um, and they end up just not making much progress. Okay, so we're gonna go over first kind of what people do wrong uh, when they're using them. All right, so what tends to happen a lot, we'll get set up, and then Basically, because there's so much resistance, you can bounce straight out of the bottom, right? And Ben will show you right there. If you look, there's not a whole lot of back engagement going on, okay? Especially once he comes down, the resi resistance band is just shooting him straight to the sky, all right? And then the other thing that happens is we'll like, it lets us reach our chin over the top. So it bounces you out of the bottom, and then you just reach, and the shoulders go forward, um, and you're getting like nothing um, on your back, okay? So, right way to do it. Okay, is to really just slow everything down. Straight out of the bottom, it's a lot of resistance, but you just have to control yourself and then make sure you're squeezing here. So driving the elbows down, keeping the shoulders down or driving them out of the bottom, and then bringing your chest to the bar. Okay, so versus throwing your chin over the bar, that brings you forward, we're gonna lean back a little bit and then have the chest go straight to the bar. All right, so hopefully that helped you guys out and we'll see you next time.